Stevenson gets the 33-21 win over Wilkes here on homecoming at Mustang Stadium. Glenn Clark with Stevenson coach Ed Hoddle. Coach, this was a wild game with a lot of big momentum-changing plays, but it seemed like every time you needed a play either from your offense or from your defense, somebody stepped up and made one. Yeah, and we've talked about that a lot. You know, you know, being a good football team is, is, is doing your part. And, you know, guys stepping up in big spots, Brody Coleman with two interceptions today, um, you know, Chaz Lyles' day, you know, those guys stepped up in, in big moments. And, um, you know, we, we look for those guys to do that. You know, the hope is we don't put ourselves in position to need those huge plays but we were in that situation today and the guys really answered the bell yeah, you talk about Chaz Lyles I don't know how many times you've had guys that have gone for rushing passing and receiving touchdowns two passing touchdowns in the mix as well is there anything that he can't do no he's a dude and we talk about it all the time in the staff room um, you know we want to get the ball in his hands as often as possible and, and when it's in his hands good things are going to happen and you know he's one of those guys that that you know does just about everything right you know he's, he's great in the classroom he's a great guy um, and, and a tireless worker at practice and and for him to come out and have a day like he did today not surprising but very impressive nonetheless the efficiency with which your quarterback Ty Crabb has handled himself in these last three games since taking over and another really efficient effort today um, doing the things that you're asking him to do and, and not turning the ball over I don't know what more you could ask for from a young man he's doing well he's uh, he, he's growing into his role and um, you know, we're proud of the progress. There's still a lot of work to do, um, you know, both on the coach's side as well as as well as his side, um, you know, as we get to know, you know, what he likes and what he's, you know, what he's good at. And, you know, having Dan, you know, been around for so long, you know, they knew, you know, they could almost, you know, Coach Larson and Dan could almost communicate without talking. Um, and, and we're not there yet. And I think it's it, it's going to be a process and, you know, one that, 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 that everybody's willing to do and they know it's going to take hard work and, and we're proud of the progress to date. You mentioned, uh, obviously, Brody Coleman with the two interceptions, but how about Hanif Jones with a pair of sacks after the week he had last week? And then adding Datu was all over the field today, and uh, and even Brian Latham making that play down at the goal line. Uh, your defense really stepping up. Yeah, those guys have really, uh, you know, over the last several weeks, really stepped up, you know, what they're doing, and they're, they're playing at a, at a very high level. Um, you know, today was a challenge, and you know we knew coming in that, uh, that that their quarterback was 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 a problem. I mean, he's he's probably the best quarterback I've seen at extending plays and doing some of the things that you know that, that cause defenses problems. And and I think you know our, our guys answered the bell. I mean, he, he caught us short a couple times for sure, um, but he's a great player, and, and and our guys were able to to make plays. And you know, fortunately, at the end of the day, we made more plays than they did. Coach, I know you're going into your bye, but just the atmosphere today, sold-out crowd, homecoming, what does it mean to win this game and be a part of this for Stevenson University? Well, for us, you know, that's our job, and, and I talk to the guys all week. You know, it's not about the dinners. It's not about the dances. It's not about the activities. Our job is to win the football game. Homecoming just isn't as festive unless the football team wins, and, you know, and that's doing our part to, to contribute to the atmosphere. And, you know, it's always great to play, you know, here at Mustang Stadium. You know, our, our students do an awesome job, our, our, our families and our parents and our alumni today do an awesome job and um, you know I mean you, you can hear them I, I, I had to go to a double headset wow. because of the noise at home um, and, and, and keep it coming you know it, it, it's a great atmosphere and you know everybody does a really really good job supporting us and, and what it is that we do on Saturdays in the fall and um, you know I'm proud to be here. Coach uh, enjoy the win enjoy the bye and we'll talk to you here in a couple of weeks. Thanks I appreciate it. He is Coach Ed Hoddle I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com